I chose Simply Coding for my son because he really enjoys uh, playing computer games. And as a mom, computer games for me are not just okay all the time. I wanted him to be able to do something that would help him learn and grow. So welcome to video two of four. The question really is, is not should my child learn coding, but rather how can I best provide my child with that coding education? We have proven methods tested on thousands of kids. In fact, we got feedback from each of them along the way to help us develop our pathway. We will guide your child into learning these valuable coding skills for any future job, college preparation, or internship. Make sure you watch all four videos. We're going to show you a lot more. We're going to help your child know how to build their resume with their own coding, coding portfolio. They're going to learn real-life computer skills applicable to any job market. It's going to build their self-esteem and their confidence. We're going to show you a view inside of our curriculum and the proven methods of this day to how to connect children to technology and teach them these valuable skills so they do not get left behind. Instead of playing Minecraft, they will be learning how to code their own Minecraft modules and enjoy learning these valuable computer language skills. So let me go ahead and click on one of them and you can actually play their game and see what they're capable of. So we'll do the first place one. And let me mute this tab. He did some serious music to it. Here we have instructions. So he wrote how you're going to play the game. And so you can go through here, see everyone that you're going to run into. And if you'd like, you can hit on view page source and you can actually see the code that he typed out. So this is all JavaScript that he learned from doing our courses and then used it to build his own game. Now you could go into the credits. I don't know what's in here. Looks like that part didn't get finished. Um, let's go ahead and play the game. There is a level editor where you can create your own game. But if you hit play game, you are this wizard and you move around and you can shoot fireballs and they go the direction that your mouse is pointing. So there's a lot of cool math involved with this, with finding the slope, um, different um, things that you're doing with trigonometry, finding the triangles, and then pushing the object in that direction. So this is pretty sophisticated stuff that he was able to understand and do. And then you can see the monsters come after you. And as you shoot, you lose mana. As they hit you, you lose life. And so a really fun game. And you can go in here and see all the different games that the kids made. Now what we wanted to show you was these students are capable of some really cool things. Once they finish the course, they're ready to start building their own stuff and we want to keep them motivated by having these little competitions. Now the whole goal of our courses is just to do that, for them to be able to develop their own ideas, to code them, and to be able to organize them and show them in a job interview or a college application. So as they're doing these things, we're having them build a portfolio. And here is a little example of a portfolio. We don't just do games but we teach them how to build websites. And we kind of start with websites because we want them to be able to build a website being their portfolio. And we do use some games because it's a great medium for kids to understand and be able to translate computer logic into something that they're familiar with. So as your student goes through, he's gonna have an opportunity to not just code what our lessons tell him to, but then expand and be creative and start coding his own things to become college and career ready. So opt in below and you'll get our video of our top proven methods and strategies that we've developed from feedback of thousands of kids to teach your child how to code and actually love it. And also as a reminder, our next video is coming out in two days and it's going to talk about how you can make one of the best decisions you'll ever make for your child and change their life forever. You'll be able to be proactive in your child's education. So opt in below. Thanks.